Hello, I'm Lamar Marshall, Cultural Heritage Director for Wild South. This video clip, I'm going to take you across the uh, Blue Ridge Mountains, beginning at Clayton, Georgia, Sequoia Old Town. And I just want to give you a sense of the terrain that the Cherokees dealt with and how the paths followed the, along the lines of least resistance through the valleys, on the biting ridges, and over the gaps. So we're going up a, a valley here, flat, easy to travel. Usually there's a little few streams to cross. But uh, generally the trading paths followed right along the valleys, the creeks, and then they were ascended, as you can see here, over uh, little gaps. And the mountains get rougher, but the trails have to sometimes uh, run along the mountainsides. But generally, it was either on the top of ridges or in the valleys. And you can see the gaps and see how the trail wound. And what we're doing, we're ascending westward from the lower towns over to the overhill towns, but you got to cross the Blue Ridge to get there. So now you can see a major gap that the trail has followed right through and then it ascends down the other side of the, of the mountain the drainage. Of course, the trails also picked out the, the best routes to, to hit the rivers, uh, the best fords. And uh, we'll see a river coming up here in a minute. And there was a ford under that bridge there. And then the trail, since the train was so rough, got up on a ridge and then followed around, uh, missing the big high part of the mountain and sticking to the lower side slopes but uh, I think you get the picture now. These mountains were rough. It took a, you had to be in good physical condition to cross them. The trading while leading your pack horses.